<laughs> donut. And there are two acceptable answers. I'll take either or both. D-O-U-G-H-N-U-T. That's one. Can you give me the other? D-O-N-U-T. <laughs> Nailed it. Go get your donut. Thank you. You're so kind. <laughs> um. I spell it the second way, you, Tracy. Guy's yes, good. although it makes He's sense to spell it the first Either way, way since there works. is dough involved. Yes, well, that was Drew Carney hitting the streets because today is National Donut Day. We have Crazy Aunt Lindsay back in studio. Now she yes. brought donuts, not just any donuts, Blue Star Donuts. And Lindsay, you recently visited Blue Star to kind of find out the science behind donuts, which mm -hmm. It's true. Baking yeah, is a, a lot science. Oh, uh, donut making is super scientific. It's filled with math and all kinds of things. So uh, donuts are incredible, but they have a really interesting American history here in the United States. Uh, the uh, Salvation Army is actually the reason why we have National Donut Day, and it's to honor the women who went to World War I, World War II, and the Vietnam War, providing donuts and hospitality to the men on the front lines. Who knew it had such a history to it's it? Right. It's really, really incredible. And so so um, to talk about the science of donuts a little bit, I brought chef, uh, uh, head chef Steph Thornton <laughs> from Blue Star. <laughs> head <laughs> chef Steph, I like it. Um, who helped me uh, come up with this great project. So if you want to know a little bit more about the life science behind donuts, so there are two kinds of donuts, cake and yeast donuts. So and we're we gonna like them both. And Either they or. are both super yep. delicious. <laughs> so yeast, um, which look, this is dry active yeast. Yeast is a living organism. These are microorganisms that are alive inside of this little package. And all you have to do is to see their, them come to life is put them in a little bit of water with sugar. So that's which what is, you did here? Yep, which, with sugar, which is their food. And as they eat, they multiply or reproduce. And as they do that, they do this thing that I love called Yeast farts. Yeast farts, right. <laughs> oh. So they emit, <laughs> they emit uh, carbon dioxide, which you and I also do when we burp or pass gas. Uh, that is what we all do. And in this case, you can see it kind of come to life um, in the form of these bubbles that begin to form. So the bubbles grow in the bag. If you wait about an hour, putting this in a sunny windowsill, it truly blows up very, very large. And that articulates itself in this beautiful dough that we so have Stephanie, here. So Stephanie, do you think about the science of it when you're putting it together? <laughs> always, yeah, you have to yeah, always, I bet you do. Yeah, we have to have think, think about the, all the, right. the Because the, the, the you generally have to think about the temperature of the water to bring the absolutely. yeast to life. Absolutely. Yeah. And how much so, sugar you're gonna add for the speed of the yeast feeding. Mm -hmm. So it's, a, it's all yeah. And how about our temperature outside? Does our weather sort of play into how always. you go about making always. it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Portland's pretty hard because the rainy weather. The damp isn't <laughs> really for baking. So yes. The lack of sun. <laughs> you do, Stephanie, turn this into that eventually? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So it starts kind of here. And then this is actually, it's been um, sitting overnight in our refrigerator. So, and it so it's already up. been, yeah. So there's a lot of little air holes in there and it's already been gassing, yeast mm -hmm. farting. Gassing. Um, <laughs> you will never think so about eloquent. a donut the same again. And donut. then we get this eventually. How long, yes. what's the whole process timeline? Like how long to go from this to that? Uh, typically this is about 18 hours and then it's another like mm -hmm. six hours or so before they actually turn into the It smells so, so good. And, and as a special treat for Do National Donut Day, Blue Star has invented an incredible new flavor called Poppin' Funfetti. Oh, snap. <laughs> <laughs> can I have this on the yes. end? Yeah. I'm gonna, yeah. Can I try oh, that? Yeah. Anything with yeah. Funfetti, sure. we're Tracy, in. We some. Stephanie, the head pastry chef at Blue uh, Star, thank you. Tell us where we can find Blue Star. Oh my God, all over town. But yes. uh, today, <laughs> head to downtown 13th and Washington. That's mm -hmm. our, our big That's store. The, yeah, Happy the National ships. Donut yeah. Day. Crazy Aunt Lindsay, tell us where to find your videos. Uh, the Fab Lab mm -hmm. and YouTube slash Crazy Aunt Lindsay. Okay, thank you both mm -hmm. so much. Cheers.